Hey everybody, welcome to Motion Brain. Today is my first tutorial and I hope you like it and I just want to show you how to make this nice looking low poly tree in Cinema 4D. We will start with a cube, press C, select the top and scale it down with T, with the shortcut T or with this icon here on top. After that, we're going to extrude it with D. And we will press D again. We will move this part to the right. Maybe a bit down. And we, we will press D again. Scale it down, move it to the left and to the right here, D again, scale it down, let's see, yeah. D again, go up a little bit and D again like this. Now we created our trunk. To create a nice blue poly look, you have to delete the font tag. Let's start with the splines. I will use the pen tool and create some branches. So I will change into the front view, select one point and create a nice looking branch. After that, I'm going to select the points and move them up and down. Like this. And then I will choose the sweep object down here and create a rectangle spline. Just drag the spline object down to the sweep object and the right angle between the sweep and the spline object. And then after that, change the size down to, let's say, 35. Select the sweep object and move the second point down. And then select this sweep object, open the details and drag the second point down. So, we, so you will create a nice looking branch. You can always change the size. I'm going to change it up to, let's say 70, 70 and drag it down. After that, I'm going to create another spline. And like this. And then I'm going to copy and paste the first spline, delete the spline object and drag the other spline object down. And then I press Ctrl A to select all the points and move them up. We will change the size to 15 like this and select this point, put it up. Yeah, 
like this. And then we will delete the phone text again. Just repeat these steps and create more branches. And now we just need the leaves. Turn the both object off. And now we, we will create a sphere. Press C, delete the font tag. And under this icon here, under the band object icon, we will, need, we will create a displacer and we will create a polygon reduction. We will select both and drag it down under the sphere. And now we need to select the shading. Go under the shader, choose noise, go to the sphere and change the size like this. And now you have created the first, your first leaf. Just move it into the tree, choose a position, maybe scale it. When you're not okay with the number of the polygons, you have to increase or change the percentage of the reduction strength. Maybe change also under the displacer and object the height. And now we've got our first leaf. Maybe 200 is a little bit too much, so we just go down to 22. Select it. This looks good. Now we copy and paste it. Move it to the top here. Select it and drag it down. Like this. Drag it down. Re rotate it a little bit and something like this. Nice. Just copy and paste all the leaves on the branches. When you're happy with all your leaves, we just need to texture it. I've created two textures with Photoshop, the green one and the brown one. So I select both of this and go down to the drop down menu for the textures. I select both and turn off the reflectance. After that, I'm going to name it leaf, leaf and wood. And then I, I'm gonna drag the leaf to the leaves object and the wood texture to the branches and to the trunk. And then yeah, you did it. You just did a nice looking low poly tree with Cinema 4D. I hope you like it. Leave a comment, subscribe and see you next time.